Hey everybody, welcome back to Positive Bluebird to part two of craftiness. Sorry about that. I ran out of memory and I had to take out a couple of files on my phone in order to uh, restart this vlog. Anyway, um, I'm going to take some extra canvas and I'm going to cut out a rectangle and hot glue some blue jean material around it. Hopefully you can see it. Um, I take blue jeans that are either shredded, torn, ripped, whatever, and don't fit my son or my husband anymore. And I recycle them by cutting and reusing it for um, booty bags, totes, whatever I feel like crafting with. So I'm going to cut a rectangle and I'm going to hot glue it onto a piece of canvas. And then I will hot glue it on the back of this um, leather little purse. It's like the size of your hand. It's really small. So I like to use small purses if I'm just going out for, um, you know, like running errands or whatever. And I don't need to carry the entire kitchen sink and house with me. <laughs> okay, over here, I made this a long time ago. And you can take craft paper and wrap it with plastic and this is just like heavy um, recycled plastic from when I worked at the elementary schools years ago as a co-teacher. I used to have to go do lamination and there was so much lamination left on the floor that I would roll it up and bring it home. So I covered it over some paper, stapled it. I know that looks tacky but that's going to be covered later because it's not quite done. And then what I did was I hot glued ribbon to the edges, folded it, stapled it, but obviously hot glued um, the ribbon over the staples. And then um, it just becomes a cute little pouch for your cards. And then this paper clip, you could always hot glue or hand sew a flower or something to it to make it a little more decorative. Or you could even go to um, like, oh, I don't know, Family Dollar or, um, you know, like maybe your paperware supply or um, what am I trying to think of? Um, your office supply store. And they have different paper clips that are colored that would look a little bit fancier than this one. Over here, I have some felt um, scarves that I got actually from Dollar Tree. I couldn't believe it. And they're really pretty. So I cut them down to size and I use them for whatever it is that I'm crafting with. Whether I'm making small little cell phone totes, purses, what have you. And then this is what my stepdaughter was working on a while back. She hasn't had time, but... Maybe she forgot about it. So these felt squares we got from a craft store and she hot glued the edges together. And then I found from the drawer some feathers that I forgot about. And then we put beads on the end. So I thought that would be cute if she hot glued that in the center. And then she's going to come up with her own little handle. So. That's about it. Oh, actually, I forgot. There's one more. Forget about that. We took canvas from a craft store and plastic ribbon. And my stepdaughter just sewed the edges with the plastic ribbon. So it's going to be kind of a see-through tote. And then I found in my craft drawers some cute little ribbons. This is pink and orange. And she's going to put in the middle with hot glue. And then we found these pink little flowers that have orange in the middle. And she'll hot glue them just like that. And then her dad works at Ace Hardware, so he will probably bring home um, a different colored chain. And she'll attach it to the edges. 